The FDA is expected to OK a mix and match approach to COVID-19 booster shots. The authorization could come within 24 hours. Well, thanks for joining us. I'm Todd Quinones and I'm Trisha Keen. Well, the FDA is not planning to recommend one shot over the other. The data showing a combination of shots offered protection against the virus. This coming as more people get vaccinated and COVID-19 infections, deaths and hospitalizations appear to steadily fall across the country. The 13 Action News reporter Alyssa Bethencourt now joins us live to explain how this could all work, Alyssa. Yeah, Tom, the FDA is saying it's safe to get a different shot than the one you originally received. So, for example, if you got the Pfizer vaccine back in March, well, then now you could get the Moderna booster. Regardless of what you choose, doctors say boosters are key in the fight against COVID-19. Any day now, the FDA is expected to authorize the mixing and matching of COVID-19 booster shots. That means tens of millions of Americans could be rolling up their sleeves once again. Carlene Freeman says after seven months of waiting, she is ready. Actually, I'm going to go get my booster maybe in another week. A study done by the National Institutes of Health looked at all three vaccines and found that no matter the brand, all study participants saw a substantial uptick in antibody levels after a booster shot. The study also showed that mixing boosters could provide a much stronger response to the Delta variant. Well, there's no reason to think that there are any problems that are going to be caused by mixing and matching the vaccines. This is kind of where we expect it to be all along. Dr. Brian Labus, an infectious disease specialist with UNLV, tells 13 Action News the move to mix and match vaccines could also mean easier access for people. I would expect that they're going to approve this and they're going to provide the protection by allowing people to get whatever vaccine is convenient for them. 13 Action News asked people if and why they wanted to receive the additional dose. I don't want to be sick and I'm not ready to die. So that that was reasons enough for me. Who wants to die? You know, came out the vaccine for a reason. Other people we spoke with said they were open to another shot, but mixing and matching may not be for everyone. No quiero mezclarlas porque. Cristino Martinez told me he doesn't want to mix the vaccines because he received Pfizer and he believes it was effective, so he wants to keep it that way. Regardless of what you choose, experts say a booster is key in the fight against COVID-19. If you don't have the booster shots, it's not that you will be unprotected. You just won't have the strongest protection possible. So additional people could get infected, which we want to avoid. But really, the goal is to get everyone vaccinated in the community. 